Hey guys, just wanted to quick make a quick video here showing the uh, little Harlequin 128 uh, issue 3B that could here. Um, this guy is my uh, Plato term uh, for RS-232 devices uh, test bed. So um, a little bit about what's happening here, uh, basically, in no uncertain terms. We have a uh, an RS-232 cable here that's made for this machine. It goes out to a nice little 9-pin serial connector here. That goes to a uh, fairly standard uh, RS USB to RS-232 adapter, which then plugs into a Raspberry Pi Zero, which is running TCP Serra. What that gives us is essentially a modem-like interface to the internet. So we can, after a fashion, symbol shift here. Log into Irata Online and be able to use the system just fine. Since we're using a ZXHD here, you can see the output is actually extremely crisp. And actually has even more vibrant color than what you're seeing here on the phone. Go ahead and look at some notes files real quick and just jump right to them using the go command. And once the border stabilizes here, you'll actually see that there's some color here. See? Nice and bright. And nice and very crisp, actually. So, we go ahead and hit the extend key. We'll go ahead and hit shift S for shift stop. And we will go ahead and hit extend D for data to keep going. And just as a little test here, we'll go and um, let's see here. Uh, hmm. I'm going to do something we know we can do. Let's try... Uh, hmm, what can we do? What can we... Can we actually get far enough? Actually, wait, sorry. Backspace! What is the backspace here? Uh, nope. Okay. Let's see. Why am I drawing a blank now on stuff I can test with? It must be late. Yeah, I can't go there. Oh, that's fine. Anyway, uh, more to come. Just wanted to show that the harbor actually worked. So, here we are. Harlequin here. I need to put it inside the case but we need to take and drill the holes for those two additional ports right over there. I'm doing that this weekend. So, and a little Raspberry Pi to be the modem and RS-232 device. SpectreNet's coming soon. Talk to you guys soon. Later.